in your love. You can't play the game. What up, what up, what up, what up, YouTube? What's happening, man? It's a lot going on out here, man. Y'all already know what it is when I pop up on the stream, man. Money Challenge Mondays. I'm going to be in and out. I ain't even going to be long. You feel me? I just want to chop it up with you guys. Make sure you guys on top of y'all business. You feel me? It's a lot going on out here. Uh, I was watching the news uh, a couple days ago. Uh, dude in Memphis shooting people at random. You know what I'm saying? That ain't cool, man. So, you know, we on the time schedule out here. Nobody knows the, the, the hour, the minute, the second, the day, nothing. You feel me? So, with that being said, we got to start getting things done. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people, they're after success. And a lot of people, they want success, but they don't know how to get success. And it's a lot of things that we need to learn. It's a lot of things that we have been taught. We need to flush uh, the bad out, keep the good. You know what I'm saying? I would just say unlearn and relearn. You feel me? The things that you want to unlearn, those are the things that's been keeping you held back from becoming successful. You feel me? So I want you guys to start focusing more on setting those goals, staying on top of those goals, and working toward those goals. Pay attention to the ones that they don't clap when they see you doing good. You feel me? Get rid of those people. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, those are the ones that's praying. I'm talking about literally praying that you don't make nothing happen in your life because they already made a decision in their lives that, hey, I ain't going to be nothing. I'm going to just work my job. I don't plan on being successful. I just want to party, get drunk, get high, spend all my money. You feel me? I don't want to take no trips. I don't want to build no wealth. I don't want my family structure to be intact i don't want to see nobody else around me successful so those are the people you got to get rid of them people you feel me because their actions should be telling you that hey this person ain't got nothing going on this person don't ever talk about no dreams they don't talk about no goals i don't ever see them working toward no goals i don't ever see these people I mean, they don't have no type of future, you feel me? So I want you guys to stay away from those people. I don't give a damn how long you've been knowing them. You can be knowing them for 5, 10, 20 years, however long, you feel me? Leave them fucking people where they at, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, for the Money Challenge Monday videos, Sacrifice Now, Shine Later, these are for my people they don't want to be average anymore. You feel me? I know when I first started, I was saying, yeah, this is for the average individuals. We passed being average right now. We ready to elevate. You know what I'm saying? Elevation requires separation. So at the end of the day, in order to elevate, you're going to have to start separating yourselves from people that don't want nothing out of life. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people, they don't really want nothing. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people, they just want to go to work, come home. Drink their liquor, watch whatever sports or watch whatever reality TV show or whatever they're into. And they don't have no vision for their life. They don't have no goals. They don't have no ambition. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, my people, I know you guys have ambition. I know you guys have goals set. I know you guys got budget plans in place. You know what I'm saying? That's why you've been sacrificing for the last couple of months. And I, we ain't even on weeks no more. We on months. You know what I'm saying? We got, we on week number eight, I think this is. We got two more weeks to go. Y'all got two grand put up. I want you guys to either A, invest that money into that business. You feel me? Uh, B, put that money, uh, pay down some debt. Or C, just sit on it, you know what I'm saying? Utilize it for your emergency fund. But either way, I don't want you guys to keep uh, spending your money on things that don't matter. Things that's not helping you to become successful, you dig? I want you guys to get focused. And I want you to stay down until you come up. Sacrifice now so you can shine later. You know what I'm saying? It's a recession going on right now. It really ain't no time to be partying because a lot of people, they just want to celebrate the struggle. I don't want y'all celebrating the struggle. I want you guys... Focus, you know what I'm saying? Y'all got to get focused out here. In order to get focused, you got to get rid of the distractions, you know what I'm saying? And the distractions, it might not be 
what you think it is. It might be something that you're not even aware of. So I want y'all to start paying attention to your surroundings. Pay attention to the people that you hang out with. Pay attention to the uh, the TV shows that you watch. Pay attention to what you're uh, engaging in on social media. Pay attention to what you're spending the most of your time with. Because that might be the distraction that you need to get rid of. You feel me? Because your mind can play tricks on you. You dig? And if your mind playing tricks on you. You ain't going to be able to see what's in front of you because it's right in front of your face. You feel me? Just like you able to get to week number eight and you got two more weeks to go. You got two bands in your pocket. You got money that you can start your business with. You can invest it. You can um, save it for your emergency fund. You can pay down some pay down some uh, credit card debt. Man, that's a lot you can do with two grand right now. That's a lot of people that ain't got five hundred dollars y'all way past that you dig so i want you guys to stay focused get super focused out here and, and utilize your time wisely you know what i'm saying because like i said tomorrow ain't even really promised to nobody you feel me so with the time that we got find out what your purpose is you know what i'm saying uh if you pray you know what i'm saying pray to god pray to your creator you know what i'm saying it's, it's right in front of your face but just Pray for what you want. You know what I'm saying? And not don't just pray. Walk towards it. You know what I'm saying? Take two steps forward. He gonna take four steps for you. You dig? And like I said, pay attention to the distractions. The ones that's around you, the ones that's not clapping, the ones that don't want to see you succeed, get away from them people, man. Because them people right there, they're they're the ones when I told you to pray so you can make it happen. They're the ones that's praying that you don't make it happen. Please don't let, please don't let them make it happen, man. Cause she ain't gonna be my friend no more. She gonna, she gonna leave. Uh, I'm gonna be in this position where I'm at by myself. Hey, that's on that person. You feel me? Because if they see you watching the videos, they see you taking the steps, they see you writing down the goals, they see you uh, saving your money. You letting them know, hey, I ain't gonna go out to uh, happy hour. This Friday. Matter of fact, I don't even want to drink no beer. I don't want to drink no liquor. I don't want to smoke no weed. Look, I think I need to go sign up for the gym. I need to change my eating habits. You know what I'm saying? I want to lose some weight. I want to be around these type of people. That's, and that person, if that person is patting you on the back and that person is pushing you toward that, that's somebody that you can keep around. You feel me? Because a lot of people, they don't want to see their friends or their family or their loved ones elevate because they feel like well shit i ain't got time to be trying to change you know what i'm saying i'm already this what it is i don't see nothing better for my life so shit you my friend i don't want you to lose i mean leave you know what i'm saying and leave me behind you know so i just want you guys to pay attention to that you know what i'm saying because it's a lot of people like i said you know how to, you got these holidays they about to start coming around you feel me? And with these holidays coming around, I know y'all going to be tempted to go spend money that you don't have. So I don't know what y'all going to do when that when that time comes. But like I said, go ahead and invest into a skill set. Because like I told you guys in the last video, I actually invested into a skill set. And I've been working on the skill set. I'm learning what I need to learn. I bought this laptop. You know what I'm saying? I've been working diligently on using it and doing what I'm doing with my skill set and it's like hey it's starting to pay off I can see down the road I can see the future I can see what's happening I can see where I want to be at you feel me I can see me positioning myself to get there you feel me and the only way I'm gonna get there is I gotta stay down until I come up sacrifice not shine later y'all know what it is I think we had week number eight week number eight it is what it is Open up the vault. $100. That's where we at, y'all. I hope y'all got y'all money. Stop playing. Stop playing with yourself. You don't want to look yourself in the mirror and say, damn, I spent money that I know I shouldn't have been spending. You feel me? Stay focused on your goal. You dig? Don't let the distractions take you away from your destiny. You dig? But anyway, we yeah, had what? Two, six, eight, ten. Hundred dollars. Week number eight. We're gonna seal up the vault. 
You guys have two more weeks to go. Two more weeks to go. Two bands. You know what I'm saying? We're going to work on band number three. I don't know how I'm going to do that one. I might speed y'all up a little bit. Some of y'all might not be ready yet, but I don't, I don't know. I, I haven't decided yet. You know what I'm saying? Because we might just do the four-week money challenge, but we dropping 250 in, in the envelope. You know what I'm saying? But nah, I ain't going to jump out there like that. Not yet, but we will be getting to that. But I want you guys to get prepared. Two more weeks to go. Week number nine coming up. It's your boy Trust No. I'm out.